Yo, what's up there guys? My name is Walter, otherwise known as Complete Seas, and I'm going to be showing you this really cool effect right here. It's called CC Vector Blur, the best montage effect that I think. It's very standard in Adobe After Effects, and I fi finally figured out because my friend told me about it. Anyways, this is what it looks like, and um, kind of like looks like a saturation type of thing. Anyways, uh, finally, let's hope the export settings work this time, because last time it was never working and stuff like that. So anyways, you can just type in CC VEC. Or you can even type in just CCV, and you'll see CC vector blur. Drag that onto your clip, onto your clip, and um, or you can even do it in a um other layer, new, and then adjustment layer, control R Y. But I can't do shortcuts right now. I have no idea why. But anyways, um, I'm just going to uh, split the layer. I can't do shortcuts. I hate that. Okay, and um, anyways, so like, what you're gonna do? is you're going to try to find the spot right before it, the scope co starts coming out so right here right right here is where the spot is and hit E on your uh, layer and it keyframe the amount go one frame forward 30 is a good amount of effect it's up to you you guys choose whatever the heck you want and then let that just die down so give it a couple times a couple seconds between that and then Bam, try to find the best spot. Keyframe, keyframe, right there. So then you just go click keyframe and zero. Go one frame forward. Let's do some, like, let's do, like, we'll make it die down a little bit. So let's go to like, 25 or so. So 25. Because it doesn't have to, don't make it, like, do the same thing every single time. Don't make it do the same time after each of time. So don't just, like, copy, paste, copy, paste. I mean, you can to get it done with, but it's not, like, the best thing you can do. So like, and for this one, like, let's say you just wanted to like, do it really crazy, you can do that. Um, but this is a really short tutorial. Thank you guys for watching it. And the final effect, I just did it in a couple seconds. Are very good, cheap, or like it comes with Adobe After Effects. Very good effect for CS 5.5. That's what I have. And hope you guys like it, and hope it's very useful for you guys in the future. <laughs> If you guys have any montages that you've made by using this effect and you've used this tutorial, just post in a video response. Anyways, peace. And remember, stay easy. You can never forget that. Never forget that.